What's up YouTube? This is NoJC1 and um, I'm bringing you guys a singles Wi-Fi battle against some guy I met on TPX. So here is the battle. Um, this was an okay battle. I've had a lot better but I sort of screwed up myself so I sort of blame myself for this one. I'll leave with my WTF my cigarette and um fearing the obvious fake out I switch out into my Terrakion to um easily resist it so since it goes for a fake out I take it obviously easily because it's not very effective but he switches out now fearing the um CC close combat into Don Fan the tank of defense and it's gonna eat this choice bandit um close combat like it's nothing and just shrug it off and get to eating its leftovers so it's oh snap it doesn't have leftovers it had a red card my bad I had a red card I forgot that and that was my other battle and um I get switched out into Tornadus during the stone edge I go into my Sigilith and I went into Sigilith because if you went for the Stone Edge, I'd rather have Sigilith die over Tornadus. But anyway, now he goes for the um, Ice Shard. He goes for two Ice Shards actually, and they do a big chunk of damage. But I survived them both. And now I just go for the Ice Beam, and that easily takes him out because I'm Life Lord. And if you're wondering why you don't see any damage coming from my life orb, it's because I have magic guard, which means I only take damage from attacks. Um, now he goes into his Alakazam, and of course he's going to go for Shadow Ball, but I really have nothing to take a Shadow Ball, so I sort of stay in. And WTF dies. Well, it did good anyway, it got off one kill. Now this was the best part of the battle right here. I go into my hardcore Embor, which he thinks, but really is my Zorark. So he goes for the Psychic, it doesn't affect, and I go for the Night Aid. And it brings him down to a Sash. So with the accuracy drop, I was hoping that. Um, he was going to miss the Focus Blast, but my luck, the Focus Blast hits, and it hits me hard, and I go down to my Focus Sash, and I transform back into my Zorark, and now I go for the Flamethrower, and hold up, that is my phone. Anyway. My bad, guys. And anyway, he goes into his Entei and during the extreme speed, he goes. I go. What the heck am I talking about? I go into Terrakion during the extreme speed and with Entei's viciously high attack and it's life orb. The extreme speed does some decent damage for being not very effective. But I, of course, have to kill it off now. And I go for the close... Not close on it. I'm all screwed up today. The Choice Bandit Stone Edge. So now, Entei, bye-bye. Entei drops like a fly. And now comes in Kobolon. I think that's how you pronounce it. Kobolon. Well, that's how I'm going to pronounce it today. Kobolon. And I'm... Um, I switch out fearing the Iron Head and go into my Tornadus. And Tornadus does not take it like a beast. It sort of takes it like a, a wimp, a weakling. And I really didn't know that these things carry Stone Edge because I really don't verse them often. But this one carries Stone Edge and it sort of punched me in the face and I sort of died. And yeah, now I send back in Terrakion. I'm like, yes, now I can kill this thing off, and I got this game easy, close combat, choice band, super effective, that's easy KO, well, I was wrong, and it sort of survives it, with like, 10 HP left, and, 
my defense has dropped, but he has the red card, so I was like, yay, clap, 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 all excited because now I might still have a chance of winning this. But it goes into my rark, and he sort of kills it off now, and I was, like, sad here now. I went through my period, and I had emotion changes, and mood swings, and now, anyway, I go, and I hit this thing with a close combat, and it does. So now I'm happy again. Hoping to win this, but it goes downhill, and I get sad again at this part. Because it freaking... Whatever this thing's called, what is this thing? Galvantula, I think. I go into my nigga, please, and this is my stuff of defense wall, and it hits me with a energy ball. I was like, yeah, if I could eat an energy ball, I'm pretty sure I could take a thunder pretty well. Well, it sort of has an electric gem and the cow pound eyes, which makes it not miss, and I get paralyzed. So altogether, I sort of got screwed up that turn. And I expected it to sort of switch, fearing a stone edge, so I went for a bulk up, but it didn't, obviously, as you can see, and I sort of pay for that mistake, and it kills me. So, I was pretty much screwed here, I didn't really know what to do. I go into my Terrakion, hoping to outspeed, because I know it's not Scarf, because they had the Electric Gem, but it outspeeds me. And I found out that its speed is only two higher than mine. So I was, like, pretty PO'd here at this point. So now I go into the original, the OG, the OG of the team. And Embor sort of takes a thunder. Not really like a beast, but he takes it. <laughs> and I get paralyzed once again. They should fix that, because Thunder should not paralyze you like that. But anyway, I smashed his face in with a freaking Flare Blitz. And obviously it's going to die, because I'm in Blaze right now. And he doesn't have a Focus Sash, because he's the Electric Gun. So now I take Mad Recoil damage, and I get my leftovers. And I was not feeling too good about this. And I pretty much knew I lost it because he still had this freaking Amy Palm. So he just goes for the fake out. I went for whatever and I sort of die and lose to Buddy. Yeah, but anyway, this is a great battle. Um, His name was like Hario5241, I think. Yeah, but it was a good battle. Um, Thanks for watching, guys. Like, comment, subscribe, please. Once I get 50 subscriptions, I don't know, I'll do something special though. You guys give me ideas. Um, but yeah. Thanks for watching guys. I'm out.